humour has still prevailed. Who would have thought the comment, I wouldn't touch him with a six foot pole, would become national policy? But there we were. This past two years, my body absorbed so much soap and disinfectant that when I pee, it cleans the toilet. It also made me think, how can it be that there is no cure for a virus that can be killed by sanitizer and hand soap? It beats me. And I still can't believe people's survival instincts told them to grab toilet paper. <laughs> One thing I was sure of during a pandemic, no matter how much chocolate you eat, your earrings will still fit. <laughs> but I did find the buttons on my jeans and tops had started social distancing from each other. <laughs> You know, during COVID restrictions, I really wanted to do a shout out to all those parents who never taught their kids respect and were stuck at home with a little bricks. <laughs> I guess that is what is called karma. When the COVID vaccines were being administered, a friend had a second dose after which he began to have blurred vision on the way home. When he got home, he called the vaccination centre and asked if he could see a doctor or go to the hospital. He was told not to bother, but return to the vaccination centre immediately and pick up his glasses. <laughs> that could have been many of us. During the stressful time of taking precautions for the coronavirus, some of us, I'm sure, went a little bit crazy. Before total isolation, I went to the bathroom at a restaurant. I opened the door with my elbow. I put down the soilet seat with my foot. I switched on the tap with the tissue. Then to leave, I opened the main toilet door again with my elbow. And when I returned to the table, I realised I forgot to pull up my pants. <laughs> season. The other day I found $20 in the car park. And I thought to myself, what would Jesus do? So I turned it into wine. <laughs> Have a lovely evening. Sit back and enjoy a few laughs and a video package put together by our own Margaret Fitzgerald. <laughs> video for this evening is a presentation by Margaret herself looking back on her time in lockdown. Listen carefully. Did she lose the plot? <laughs> <laughs>